Deuteronomy 31 verse 6. Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid or terrified. The Lord your God goes with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. Hey guys, so today I am making a custom wig construction. This is bundles that my customer provided and I'm just making this custom wig for her. First thing that I'm doing is I'm just doubling the wefts as you can see here. Um, this is a very simple and easy process. And then you'll see here, I am finished doubling the webs and now I'm finally doubling it on the cap, guys. This is more of a look and learn. I didn't really do the guideline of the wig cap measurements. So um, you can just refer back to my how to make a custom closure wig DIY sewing machine video. I'll probably link it down below so you guys can see it's a little bit more detailed. But now that I've sewed a couple tracks. That is what the hair looks like sewed down. And I'm just gonna continue the same process until I reach to the very, very end. Um, and this is what the hair looks like. Just natural wigs, hi. Um, this is what the hair looks like when it's completely constructed. Really nice, really neat. It does look a little crazy, but this is why styling is super important. And this hair was used before. My client used this hair before, so that's why the hair looks like that um now i'm just styling the wig i'm starting by parting the hair how she wants it i like to use mousse to mold down the hair and then i'm going to proceed with using my hot comb guys oh my god the hot comb is everything guys it makes the wig super flat and i recommend that if you do not have a hot comb that you purchase one today okay amazon b supply store and i believe walmart has them so definitely invest in a hot comb and i'm just using that to basically flat down the whole entire part she doesn't want any baby hair so i'm going to make this a very natural um part and then what I've done here, guys, is I've now separated the hair and I'm about to um, wand curl the hair all around. And I'm pretty much just going to like fast forward this part because it's, you know, very repetitive. So, bam, y'all, these are the wand curls. I'm on my final one. Um... You really have to have patience to make wigs y'all like oh my gosh it takes forever but i love the final masterpiece it looks so good here y'all i um i wanted to show you guys a 360 of the hair and now what i like to do is i like to tie the hair down with our satin head wrap so that it can be nice and fl even flatter i love me a flat and natural wig and then i just use the comb to kind of remove the dents and stuff and that's pretty much it guys here is the final result of the wig guys and you'll see here how i package the wig thank you guys for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this and i'll see you guys next time on my next video bye y'all